On September 24, 2016, Ogofedaran Kilai cave system witnessed an old man, Ian's terrifying escape from a dark cave that can't give way to more than one slim human at a time. They called it the Gentle Crawl, but nothing was gentle about it. He had crawled nearly 500 meters through tight, suffocating passageways, with his body rubbing against cold limestone in the dark, with barely any space to breathe or turn. Every twist felt like it was squeezing the life out of him. It was becoming more of a nightmare than a fun cave hunt. He had chosen this cave system on Khangatok Mountain as a challenge, hoping to conquer this eerie small path on his 70th birthday. But deep inside the earth, with his helmet light flickering and the darkness pressing in, he realized he had underestimated it. He had underestimated nature's power. His body ached, his hands were raw, and he was stuck, jammed between the hard rocks. Little did he know that the coming minutes would horrify him this way. It was then that fear took over. The walls seemed to close in, and he struggled to keep calm. He wanted to give up. It would be so easy, but there was no way back. At this moment, only his helmet was visible. He couldn't move his body. Will he stay stuck in here for a lifetime? But the urge to survive kept him moving. He used his elbows to make a way from the rough ground. He slowly moved forward, feeling each painful cramp. Finally, he saw light from the narrow exit. With one last push, he emerged, bruised and exhausted, but alive.
This footage of his escape from Ogofi Daran Kilai is enough to give anyone nightmares. It's a glimpse into the sheer terror of being trapped underground, fighting to survive in one of the most dangerous caves in the world. With that being said, let's move on to our second footage that is going to give you claustrophobia. On August 22nd, 2012, in Deep Cave, Edwards County, Texas, it was supposed to be a simple test of bravery, a way to earn cave cred among friends, but the footage taken that day captured something far darker. One by one, they tried squeezing through the alternate entrance to Deep Cave, a crack barely big enough to fit a person. But this was soon turning into their worst phobia for this group of friends. Nice! Yeah. Yeah. There he goes. He's able to do it yeah. pretty well. Yeah. 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 Next. You want to try? Ouch. Each of them struggled, getting stuck, their laughter fading into tense silence as their shoulders touched the stone and they disappeared. With sunglasses and thick pants catching on every edge, it became a slow fight with the earth, a feeling of being swallowed, a feeling of never coming out of it alive. This guy, this okay, your hips. Cut your legs. And just work your way out. I think my girls don't have much trouble there, but guys do if you got a big package. So. Mm -hmm. I think it's if, if you're small, it's easy to get those hips through. Otherwise, well, I can't even get my hips through. I'm just like, God, how do you? That's why I can have so much trouble with my hips. I'm not yeah. quite as worried about my hips as I am my shoulders and my head. Yeah. Yeah, we know. Throw it. Perfect. There you go. There you go. That's it. Did it. Nice. Nailed it. Fast. The cave seemed alive, like it didn't want them to leave. Jokes about getting born again turned into fear as they realized how tight the space truly was. They kicked their legs and pushed their arms, but the stone walls held them tight. They froze in fear, their faces growing red, and they panicked. The cave kept pulling them in like it had secrets of its own. I got you. I think from this way, I think facing the other way. That way is like a death wish. But that way. I don't know. I think head first either way is a death wish. Exactly. But, it's yeah. like, I don't think you'll be I able think to head first caving is the way to go. Well, yeah. okay. As long but as y'all will like pull me up As long as you know that the lead stuck. goes. If you get stuck yeah, upside down, you might die. Oh, that's true. Well, well guess... pull me up if I get stuck, please. Yeah, we'll pull you out. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, we'll just have to. There's enough of us here to. Yeah. So we do like a keg stand kind of thing? Yeah. We should wait till the sun sets before we do that. Before we do what? We hold you straight up. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> what? Kick stand. We can't yeah. hear you. Kick stand. He's all, I'm having second thoughts. <laughs> what? We can't hear you. Push. Hold you up. <laughs> push, push. He's He's like, like, pull me out. Pull me out. Here's next to a cow pose. I want, okay, has everyone yeah, who gone was? through facing that way? Yeah, that way? Okay, so right. head first is no good. We're Sit on top it. of it, cow. Mm -hmm. You can first. do it. The footage cuts out, leaving only eerie echoes. Those who watch it can almost feel the stone closing around them, the grip of deep cave, a nightmare that makes one question if they'd ever make it out again. Moving on to our next disturbing cave incidents. On December 3rd, 2016, veteran cave diver Robbie Schmidtner shared his darkest, most terrifying experience from his 17 years of exploring the underwater caves and sinkholes of Yucatan. He was deep in a cave, guiding his way through a tight passage. But as he moved, the bubbles and motion stirred up the water, making everything around him murky. Visibility dropped to zero, and soon he reached a dead end. Well, it rised up a lot, you can imagine, I think. In complete darkness, he removed his tank, pushing it through the tiny gap. Squeezing through the narrow space, he tumbled onto the other side, and his hand landed on the guideline. He had made it. But as he left the cave, the nightmare of that dive would haunt him forever. This footage, capturing his fear and survival, will give you nightmares. 
Moving on to our fourth case, which is going to give you the worst fears that you ever experienced before. On November 15th, 2022, a man encountered a mountain lion deep inside a cave. He had been digging into the dark, narrow space, focused only on his task when he heard a low, rumbling growl from the shadows. His flashlight when ran over the rocks, and there it was, a massive mountain lion, eyes glowing, watching his every move. Frozen with fear, he couldn't look away. He knew any sudden move could be his last. His heart pounded, echoing in the silence of the cave, and his mind screamed at him to back away slowly, yet his legs felt rooted to the ground. By gathering every ounce of courage, he inched backward, not daring to take his eyes off the predator. Oh, dang. This footage, capturing the raw terror and desperation of that moment, will haunt you. One wrong move, and he would have never made it out of that cave alive. With that being said, let's move on to our fifth piece of footage. On the night of October 20th, 2024, a midnight cave descent that made this man trapped 80 feet down. What started as an exciting cave exploration quickly turned into a tense, dangerous experience. The adventurers made their way deep into a cave with narrow paths, deep pits, and slippery slopes, making every step a risk. Because if your stomach was up, and I ended up like grabbing your leg and my feet slip out, I'd probably break your knee, but if it can bend the way your knee is supposed to bend, it wouldn't be a problem. <laughs> this whole situation. I really wish I had had somebody grab my bag, but I guess I just gotta jump across with it. Position. Golly, dude. With spiders everywhere, along with unstable ledges and strange symbols carved on the walls, the atmosphere of this cave was very eerie. At one point, one explorer found himself on the wrong side of an 80-foot drop, nearly trapped with no way back. Oh, oh. <laughs> that was bad. Oh god, I'm stuck. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Using teamwork, they managed a quick rescue, but the experience left them shaken. His friend was there to save him from dying in this cave alone. But what if his friend was also stuck somewhere? The legendary cave chronicles himself. In the flesh. Cave chronicles himself. I just did my first ever cave rescue. Cave rescue. Yeah. That was one of the quickest ones I ever recorded. Yeah, can we just go down here? Uh, yeah. Well, getting back up looks difficult. Oh, yeah, that was really hard to get up. Uh-huh. All right. Well, it's both We're doing good. this now, guys. Oh, you're coming down right there? I wouldn't come down right there, bro. No, I was trying. I'm going to go a little pit. In the end... The daring cave exploration led to a tense, near-rescue situation, pushing the explorers to their limits. With this footage still haunting our minds, let's move on to our next footage, where panic levels are way higher than your imagination. On November 3rd, 2023, these professional cavers decided to visit a deep-sumped cave. Their purpose was only to explore this cave, but Matt and Jacob felt eerie from the start like they were descending into another world. Little did they know that this would turn into one of their horrifying nightmares. I record, right? Yeah. Sweet. Sure and these are waterproof? Huh? These are waterproof? Make sure the gasket's sealed, yeah. All right. Get into it! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. 
third. Oh, God. A lot further. At one point, the narrow passage forced them underwater, and Jacob panicked, desperately searching for air. He missed an air pocket and, in his panic, shoved Alex under, leaving him gasping and struggling. The shadows around them grew heavier as tension rose. It was a tight space, barely enough for one person to push through, and every movement felt like it might be their last. Okay. We're not even close. Oh, yeah. There's a Though surrounded by the icy water and rocks, Alex finally surfaced, bleeding from a gash on his head. Jacob, rattled by the near drowning, was apologetic, realizing how close he'd come to putting both their lives at risk. This is barely air right here today. Oh, so loud. Oh. The echo is the waiting area. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't go in there and wait. Are you going, Jacob? Oh, he, he just bailed. Stop, stop, stop. The sight of Alex, shaken and hurt, was a reminder of how dangerous their expedition was. The group eventually decided to turn back, each of them visibly haunted by the close call. Hey, my light's on! I need a... Head bleeding, by the way, Come on, you're Yeah, you're bleeding. Yeah, I am. Okay. Not bad. Yeah, I got the flame in the rock. Yeah, no, he hit you. Yeah, Alex, you good? Oh, you hit your head back. Oh, dude, you're 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 Yeah, let's go. They left the cave shaken, knowing they'd barely escaped a watery grave that day. With that being said, let's move on to our next footage that might send chills throughout your body. On April 15th, 2023, in a somewhat remote area, this caver decided to explore one of the most haunting caves that had not been discovered yet. He had been squeezing through the narrow path for what felt like hours, with sharp rocks pressing in on all sides. He knew he had made the wrong choice by going deep into the cave. We're in a canyon now. Dang! And the can, the can, that's actually kind of crazy though, the can is right there. So. <laughs> the spray paint can. Oh my gosh. There's a little passage here. And it looks like it goes. Ah. <sighs> uh, I think I'm getting stuck. Yeah, that's pretty funny. Yeah. Oh. Um, dude, I'm like stuck, stuck. This is a bad idea. Oh. Then it happened. His helmet got stuck, completely wedged, 
and his arm was pinned under his body. Panic set in. He realized he had no way to move back, but he couldn't be pulled out either. The cave walls were too tight, too sharp. His breathing quickened as he forced himself to push forward. Every inch deeper into the darkness felt like he was giving himself over to the cave itself. I feel like at this point, you can't pull me out so sharp. I feel like I gotta keep going and maybe I can turn around in here. All right, my helmet's stuck. Completely stuck. like pinned under me oh. oh this was this was a bad idea this is a really bad idea okay you got my arm out finally he broke through only to find himself in a massive pitch black room. But as he stepped forward, he felt something cold and wet seep into his boots. A chilling stream flowed across the floor. Icy water seemed like piercing into his skin. Awesome. Let me see. Ah. Oh, that's not looking good. Oh, dude, is it small? Yeah, like really, really small. Oh, that water's freezing, man. Oh, that's not good. Dude, there's no way. I'm pushing it. I'm like down in the water. Oh. No. Actually, If we move this rock out of the way, it looks like it does. I just squeezed past this rock that was only supported on that. But look, it opens up huge. It opened up huge. Looking deeper, he saw the room open up, a huge one. He was stunned. Realizing how far they'd come, and how much the cave was still hiding. It was a journey of pure darkness, where every step brought them closer to something unknown. Something waiting in the depths. Filming off a phone now. And, uh... Looks like the stream keeps going this way, though. Yeah. Oh, man, look at this! Yeah, that's, that's crazy looking. <laughs> This was no ordinary cave. It felt alive, watching as if it could swallow them whole. On November 3rd, 2023, a deep pit cave exploration went wrong when James and his friend thought they'd prepared for anything as they repelled into the dark, yawning depths of deep pit cave. They had their ropes, flashlights, and even a backup plan. But down in that pitch black cave, with water dripping around them, everything felt colder and sharper. Then, this is like somebody's collapsible caving cup. <laughs> That's ridiculous. All right? It's old school. Very old school. Dome over here. Yeah, let me check out this dome. Tight one. Oh. I see what you mean. That's a tight one. I'm going in this hole that's so tight. I had to take my helmet off. Oh, that's tight. 
As they pushed deeper, the narrow passages grew more dangerous, squeezing tighter and scratching their helmets and hands. He crawled through a razor-thin gap, helmet off, shoulders scraping the sharp walls. It was so tight that he could barely breathe. The cave seemed to press in from all sides, a tomb of rock waiting to close in. Ah, really sharp too. Mm. I think I gotta keep going down. Oh, it actually led somewhere. Oh, look, somebody put a survey tape. Do I gotta go further down there? Let's do it. What's your way look like? Nothing. Ah, mine's got a survey tape. Really? Yeah. yeah. <sighs> this cave is so Then, just minutes later, he found himself alone, water lapping at his face in a tunnel that seemed to shrink with every breath. The water was freezing, chilling him to the bone, and he knew if the rain picked up, the passage could flood in seconds. This is not good. Like, legit, to move forward, I have to dig the rocks out. This ceiling even collapses like an inch. I'm squished like a bug. If I want to stand my head up, I can't. It just goes underwater. No space to turn, no way to lift his head above water. It was just him, the ice cold water, and the walls pressing closer, tighter, cutting off his only way out. At that moment, he knew he was one wrong move away from being trapped forever. Oh my god, I feel like I'm gonna get stuck. So the reason I kept pushing is I thought it was going to get wider, but as I'm getting closer I realize it's an illusion. The water was just so calm and still above me that it was reflecting the ceiling off and it just looked like a way bigger space, but it's continuing to narrow down. Um, I, it's been like an off and on raining type of day. Will he be able to get out of this nightmare anytime soon? With these questions still in our mind, let's move on to our ninth piece of footage. On October 10th, 2023, Montana. When a family from Seattle moved to an abandoned ghost town in Montana, they thought they were stepping into a fresh start. But something sinister was hiding in the shadows, waiting for them to arrive. It's also extremely creepy. What are you picking up? Well, I can tell you we're not alone. Okay. I keep getting told to look for symbols. Desperately looking for answers, they called in Tim Wood and Sapphire Sandalo. The investigators wasted no time. They explored into the dark corners of the property, only to make a terrifying discovery. Inside a hidden cave, strange symbols etched deep into the rock seemed to pulse with a menacing energy. I don't know what type of symbol I'm supposed to be looking for. The charcoal light? I want to hit with the UV light. Oh my gosh, Tim, look at that! A circle and with an upside down cross. Tim, see that? Oh, There's six. As they explored, 
something unthinkable happened. Tim felt sharp scratches burn across his skin, symbols that mirrored those in the cave. Every step into the darkness left him marked, as if warning them to leave. Another six. Six. It looks like six. There's another six, six. right there. Do you see the six yeah. right here? There's another one. Six. Why would these symbols be in here? When I owned the Wells house, I got six carved by an entity in the back of my neck, and it looked just like these. Just like these? Are you kidding me? No. And now we're seeing sixes everywhere. Yeah. Down here. The unsettling evidence pointed to one thing. They were not welcome here. Whatever haunted this place had claimed it long ago, and it was not willing to share. With that being said, let's move on to our last footage for this video. On October 27, 2023, these two men were exploring a cave when one of them gripped his flashlight tighter as he moved deeper into the pitch black cave. Every sound echoed in the suffocating silence, each step taking him further from daylight and safety. The walls felt alive as if the shadows themselves were watching. Then, there was a low, guttural sound, a sound not meant for human ears. Something massive was breathing in the darkness, just beyond the flashlight's reach. It was no ordinary animal. Whatever was hidden in the shadows didn't want him there. A shiver ran down his spine as he caught a glimpse of massive, glowing eyes reflecting in the darkness. Just be quiet. Just hold on. Do you hear that? Okay, listen. Carefully. Let me get past you. Here we go. The creature was watching, its presence filling the air with horror. They knew in that moment this thing wasn't just an animal. It was something far more dangerous, a sinister guardian of this cave, warning him to turn back before it was too late. Did you hear what way that came from? There's something behind us. We are at a disadvantage in this cave. There's something in here that wants to get out. We're going to be in a bad spot. In the dark of these hidden caves, explorers faced pure fear from tight spaces that nearly trapped them forever to strange creatures lurking in the shadows. These 10 encounters show the true danger of the unknown. If you ever feel drawn to explore, remember, some places are best left alone. For more videos like this, make sure you hit the subscribe button and like this video. Comment below which case you find the most terrifying. Don't forget to press the bell icon for future notifications.